Hi boys and girls, Miss Sanchez with you and in this video we're going to learn how to phrase when we read. This is the step that helps us become fluent readers. So when we first read a book like this, students tend to go Jack and Billy. Jack and Billy, I sound like a robot. We want to learn to put our words together that go together so it sounds smooth. So we can say Jack and Billy. When I say and Billy, it sounds like one word. Listen, and Billy, not and Billy, and Billy, Jack and Billy. So instead of pointing, we're learning to slide, Jack and Billy. So let's open up the book and enjoy this story. So this is what teachers usually hear. Here is my car, said Jack, I speak like a robot. Okay, but we don't want to read like robots, do we? So when we get a line like this, we have to phrase, which means put the words together that go together. So let's take two words at a time. It's usually two or three words at a time. Can we see those words? Instead of saying, here is, we can say, here is, here is, sounds like one word. My car, sounds like a robot. My car, sounds really smooth. Again, sounds like one sound, my car. So it sounds like this, here is my car said Jack. Not said Jack, said Jack. Really smooth. Eventually you'll become fluent and it will sound like this. Here is my car, said Jack. And that is what we're aiming for. Brum, brum. Now I don't have to put those together because the comma tells me to stop. Brum, brum. But these words can go together, said Jack. Nice and smooth, not said Jack said Jack. Brum, brum, said Jack. Here I come in my car. So it sounds like this. Ready? Brum, brum, said Jack. Here I come in my car. See how we didn't hear in my car? We just heard a nice smooth in my car. It sounds like one word. And that is how we read with phrasing. Putting one two or three words together that go together to sound smooth. Once again, here I come in my car. And I hope you can now practice phrasing at home so that you can be on your way to becoming a fluent reader. Keep practicing.